Okay guys, good morning to all. We are a bunch of group of young people. We are crossing the border between between uh, Slovenia and Croatia. So we are in Croatia now. We just crossed Slovenia. So the journey begins in Croatia now. See the Croatian flag. So we have the checking in Croatia now. We had the checking in before in Slovenia. Hello guys. We have just arrived to the Zagreb station. <laughs> so we'll be heading to the city center and we'll be visiting the station. First of all we'll have to take this round at the station and then we'll be heading to the city center. Uh, guys, right now we are at the station. We need to change the euro to kuna. So one kuna is about, one euro is about seven kuna. So we'll be changing it at the exchange show. We'll do that now. Grazie. Okay guys, good morning. We reached the international bus station terminal in Zagreb. Very wonderful city. Very wonderful people. It's a little tired because uh, it's a long journey. Yesterday evening we left and uh, we could not s sleep very well because I was speaking with uh, some of the people I met uh, in the journey. Anyway, we are in the city center of uh, capital town of uh, Zagreb. Let's see how the journey goes. very happy to be here uh, I'd like to explore this city and this country as much as I want but uh, according to this schedule we are only here about for a week and then we will be uh, making another trip uh, by next time Many tram services we can see here, also buses and taxis, but there are no underground metros or trains through these places because there is less population and it is a different economy. Croatia is a very beautiful country and the people are also very awesome because I would say the programs when we are going to feel is like it would be outstanding. Very beautiful places. This is a small village.
there is a lot of residential areas here and it seems like every part of the town and the villages are almost the same. From village to another village, many beautiful houses. I would have uh, probably church, schools, and some coffee bars, some supermarkets, etc. One important thing is that uh, the road signals are marked very well. What I see here is that. Every place is clean and maintained very well. I've told you International United Nations International Youth Camp. This is basically a youth camp for young people to get together. We have many activities here and it's a very exciting program. The time is over. Anyway, now we're at the cute place, a very beautiful villages that have a lot of flowers, very plants are arranged very well. Uh, you see some young people, I, I mean, we met really a lot of young people on the bus stations, but here really not a lot because they, I've been there busy with uh, their things. So. Okay guys, when we get to the station, the next station, we'll trip again. The city we are going is a deal over and it is very attractive city and it feels like the heart of Croatia. Also there is very famous equestrian sport or uh, the horse riding sport is famous in this part of city. Croatia have uh, many beaches and some of the beaches are very expensive and also the seafood are very special and it is available all the time. Also the Croatian beer are very famous too and the meat are also very different because there is a Hungarian Austro culture here and the influence is all. Although Croatia's agricultural farming is very impressive and uh, the implementations are useful to follow the whole uh, world because their organic farming is phase but still there are they make actually super quality products by minimizing the impact of uh, environment for the production every day if you would want to drive here it's a beautiful road guys look at these fields they are the corn fields so we are getting a lot of corn to the market from these fields Croatia and uh, to with that a small factory mill house But if you come across these places with the, your own car, then you can stop on a while and then maybe you can camp on the places. It doesn't require any special permissions from these areas. This country also faces many other problems than farming. Uh, many young people leave this country for uh, a long time because of uh, its uh, socialist approaches. I am not sure how can I say all these things, but it says that 
Many poorly maintained things like apartments, places, etc. are a normal thing in countryside. I really love this day. It's not so hot like in Rome. It's quite cool. a little bit very smart so it will be nice yeah. so guys we are in uh, Gol Leor it's a small city and now we are heading into the camp session we already have our friends come to pick up from the program on organizing committee is here <laughs> very beautiful small city I'm Paolo. yeah Paolo. okay I'm the coordinator in Dubrovko. Today he's the driver. Yeah, okay. Uh, I work as a physiotherapist, oh, nice. and my profession is a recreational therapy. Yeah, we have a lot of sports programs here. Yeah. Like basketball, yeah. Football, football, yeah, football, yeah, football, yeah. It's a creation program. And 13 years old. Yeah. Uh, it's based around. Yeah, yeah. And the entire International Youth Week is here to uh, help young people from different parts of Europe and the world exchange experiences. Yeah, yeah. Their skills, their knowledge. Yeah. Uh, it's all volunteer based. Yeah, yes. And the complete program is funded through donations. Yeah. So it's not like you funding the Rogers Plus. Yeah. But we can support from uh, several institutions yeah. who approve our programs and uh, to uh, validate them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So. Uh, but uh, all the financing, all the things you're gonna see there, yeah. it's all through the nations. Okay. So guys, we are in the right place. Yeah. We need to just go and sit there. We are, will have a lot to eat. We'll go and eat all our friends, okay? Mm -hmm. From now on. That's what our plan. Good plan. <laughs> yeah, that's a good plan. Uh, sometimes you, have, you will uh, see people they were never outside of their villages yes, or their, yes. their cities yeah. and we are here to provide yeah. because uh, we are here to grow the communities and to yeah. uh, give equal opportunities no matter where you're born yeah, yeah. I think that this is also the thing in India because yes, I think an opportunity or small town you don't have equal opportunities yes. uh, because transportation is the key problem yeah. do you have quality transportation service? So, bus that will take you from the Alabar, for example, to Bukovic, yeah. uh, the frequency of this bus. Yes. And secondly, uh, thirdly, the price. Yeah. Sometimes it's a problem with the price, sometimes it's a problem with the frequency, yeah. and sometimes the problem that there is no transportation. So this is the thing, yeah. our main, main problems for young people. Yeah. And we are trying to open opportunities for them. Yeah. We are sending... Uh, more than 500 young people per yeah. year yeah. on yeah. Erasmus opportunities. Yeah. Yeah. Could you please? Do you know what is population of Croatia? Yes, it's about uh, 3 million, sorry. All around 4 million. 4 million, so it's grown. Yeah. And your country? Uh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> it's <laughs> the second largest population in the world. So like 1 billion? Yeah. Uh, something seems to be very lovely. You can hear the music from nearby cottage. We got our cottage. And uh, we have been given uh, each of them one one bed is I think I'm gonna select the top one here. I got this 70. Hello guys. We are here in the cottage. Now they have started some programs for the kids. 
There's many kits that comes from different parts of Croatia here. We can watch the games. I think now they try and learn how to play basketball. Maybe it's just a practice. A very senior person from the Impress organization is talking with the young coordinator. Maybe they're sharing some ideas here. Yeah. He's also one coordinator. Nice to meet you. Uh, could you please say your name? My name is Gigi. Gigi. From Georgia. Oh, yeah. Georgia is a very near country. It's one of this. Yes. Uh, nice to meet you here. How? And, uh, right now, if you see, we can yeah. come. Yeah. Yesterday we started. Yes, yes. Today is one of the most important days. Yeah. yeah. There are a lot of elderly people. Yeah. There are a lot of activities, if you see. Yeah. Filled with the full of programs, full of programs. Every minute there is different activities. Nobody is wasting any minute. Everyone is busy with something. What are you from, sir? Uh, Rome, Italy. Originally from India. I am a physiotherapist. Also a, a recreational uh, therapist. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Okay. Very nice place. Cottage is very good. Camp. Animal house. Horse place. Very good. No, no, no. Really? Good. Crucial chess is again. They're still playing. Like they have still workshop here. Oh wow, they are making something very beautiful. Can I see something? Oh wow. Yeah, they are making bracelets. Yes, they are making bracelets. Yeah.
Thank you. <laughs> shake, 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 shake. <laughs> We have a nice little dinner. That's called uh, lasagna.